This is Waco Springs at 60 cubic feet a second or 60 CFS. I've canoed it at 800 and it's most uh, canoeable at oh, 2 or 300, 400 on a safe day. Above 400 it gets to be pretty hairy and up at 800 or 1000 or 1200 CFS it's absolutely Olympian. I think you can see that boulder right in the middle there. It's where my finger is kind of tipping. That rock has wrapped canoes around it. In other words, people didn't know what they were doing, approached the rock the wrong way, the canoe broadsided it, and make a fist, fist Christopher, make a fist, and if, as if Christopher's fist is the rock, here's the canoe coming toward the rock, and it wrapped the canoe around the rock. The force of the water was so great, and killed the people inside. In fact, we'll show you a sign on our way out. It's for emergency vehicles and ambulances. It's their entrance to get into Waco Springs because people have died right there at 1,200 cubic feet a second or 1,200 CFS.
Down the river here a little bit though, there's a rope and we used to go jumping off of this rope. I'll try to get a little picture of it. There it is. And we used to swing on that rope as it hung from the tree. We'd go under on the canoes and swing from the rope. But this is the famous and powerful, or once powerful, Hueco Springs Rapid. No longer powerful at 61 cubic feet a second.